Hello everyone, this is Amritpal Singh. Welcome to the next video. Guys, in this video, I'll be letting you know how the map and flat map transformations are different in Apache Spark RDD API. So what is map transformation? The map is a transformation which returns a new RDD by applying a function to each element of this RDD. So first of all, I'll be showing you how map works, then I'll be showing you how flat map works, and then you'll be getting to know that how they're different. First of all, I'll be creating a RDD, right? Uh, and in which I'll be creating RDD with the help of one external file, sc.txt file. And the file is available in my laptop, right? This is the file which I'm gonna load. This is the file and this is available at this location. So let me copy it and let me uh, paste it here. And here with this, I'm able to uh, create a RDD with the name map RDD. On this map RDD, I'll be applying the map transformation. So in this case, I'm, uh, putting a transformation on it map rdd dot map okay and i'm applying a split method okay so r dot split and these are space separated you can see these all elements are the space separated elements right uh, so that's why uh, i just put a space here Okay, done. So first of all, let's collect the uh, collect, uh, contents. Collect is nothing but the action in the Apache Spark RDD. We all are aware that transformation will never give you answer. If you want to get the answer, you have to call the action. So let's uh, call the action which is collect to get a result. Okay, I'm, I'm applying collect method on this map RDD2 to get answer. And you can see we got answer in the form of array of array of elements. So let me now discuss about the map. Map will always give you the data result in a form of array of array of elements. Second point is th there will be one to one mapping. If there are three lines of code in your input data, you will be getting three outputs in the output. You can see uh, Hadoop is slow is coming as one line. Uh, uh, Spark is fast is coming together. Both are good is coming together. It means it is one to one mapping. All right. And third point is map will always read the data line by line, right? And let's now let's see how the flat map is different now on the same example i'm now uh, uh, putting the uh, flat map transformation and in this case i'm just changing a name to flat map rdd okay so it's done now let's apply the flat map same same example nothing change instead of map i'll be now making use of flat map m capital and in this case let me change the rdd name also it is a uh, flat map now, flat map RDD2. And here also we can change flat map RDD, flat map RDD. All right, all done. Yes, wait, okay, uh, spelling is wrong. It is flat, done, okay. Let's apply collect method and let's see if the results are different or not. So I'm uh, putting a flat map. RD2. Please have a look to the answers. You will be getting the difference here. It was array of array of elements. Now it is array of elements only. It means the output got flattened. The flat map uh, first give you the results in flattened way. Meaning is that uh, over there I was getting the results in array of array of elements. Now it is we are getting the uh, answer in array of elements because as I've already stated, the flat map always return a new RDD by by first applying a function to all the elements to this RDD and then flattening the results. It meaning is that it is the way our map works that all the elements got affected in the same way flat map also the work in the same way but they're different in three ways. First, uh, in the case of map, we were having one to one mapping but here it is one to many mapping, right? Because over there, there were three lines of code, three, three inputs but here we are having more than three as answer like Hadoop is slow, Spark is fast, both are good, right? It is different from the input. And second thing is the map always read data line by line, but the uh, flat map reads the data word by word, right? And over there, the output is not flattened. It is area of area of elements. It means in a nested way it is coming. But in the case of the flat map, it is coming in a without in an unnested way. It meaning is flattened output, right? This is how the map and flat map is different in the case of Apache Spark RDD API. I hope from this little short video, you come to know that how the things are different. For rest of the content, I'll be coming in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next video.